Hi everybody, I'm back. Um, I haven't made a video in a while. I was waiting for my bangs to grow out. Just kidding. Um, anyway, I'm gonna make one of my favorite, favorite recipes today. Uh, usually you use um, Asian noodles, like buckwheat noodles, um, sweet potato noodles, or what you call black rice noodles. They're really, really amazing. If you can find them, you can probably get them at Whole Foods. I live in Germany and I get them at a, a um, like a, a natural nature store. Anyway, I'm going to use 99% uh, raw foods, actually English cucumbers. So I got a spiralizer and you can just spiralize. I also use zucchini sometimes, but I think, you know, cucumbers are more Asian. Um, anyway, so you get a bowl like that or a plate of... Um, plate of cucumber and then I have a little dish that I'm going to put in later after I mix it. So here's your canvas, okay? Beautiful. Start with your oil. Uh, I use olive oil sometimes. Um, if you can get um, Korean roasted sesame oil, please do so. It's amazing. I can't get that here in Germany. Uh, you can also use raw sesame oil. I use that sometimes. Okay, so olive oil, and then I'm going to put some extra omega-3 oil. It's called Leinöl in German. So a little bit of that. It's really thick, and it's really good for women, especially if you're, you know, in your 30s or 40s, 50s, 60s. You know, women need those oils because we lose them as we age. And I should add that this is my about fourth month of my raw food journey. I fell off the wagon a few times, but I got right back on. I'm drinking this delicious orange and grapefruit juice. Mmm, this is my third one today. I feel really clean and I'm so proud of myself. I've been raw so far and okay, it's not even one o'clock yet uh, in the afternoon. Anyway, so uh, vinegar, you need vinegar. I use this one, this is my favorite. My mom loves it, she recommended it to me. It's made in Germany, but you can get it in the US. It's really clean, she said, and you can taste it. You can put it in salads, you can marinate things with it. So I just put a little, I don't measure anything, you know, just eyeball everything. I, I like that idea. You, I've also tried apple cider vinegar. It works. It, it has a, a exotic taste, I like it, okay? And a pinch of Himalayan salt. One more. All right, and then a um, little bit of soy sauce. I put in a little bowl there. Just put a little bit, you know, you can always add. So, the magic ingredient is the ginger. Uh, the ginger makes it, you know, taste exotic, Asian, right? I use a garlic presser. If I just have a little tiny ginger, I will use a garlic presser. And it works. Watch this. You see the juice? It just popped out. And then you get this. And you can also eat it. I don't like chopping it and putting it in because it doesn't look good, first of all. And I don't want to be chewing on a piece of, you know, garlic. So it's really thin like that. And you can eat it. Excellent. Ginger is has been used for centuries by Asians, uh, Indian people. Um, it kills germs in your in your bowels. It revitalizes your body. You can use it in teas, and you can use it in so many different things. Okay. This is roasted uh, sesame seeds from America. My mom she roasted them herself. My favorite thing for my mom. So I just get a little bit of pinch, some cracked uh, black pepper, shake it a little bit. So I'm going to mix it with my hands. I mean, you could also use chopsticks. I have this really beautiful um, metal chopsticks. They're hollow inside, but I eat almost everything with chopsticks. So you can mix it like this if you're really into, I don't know, hygiene, but 
I, you know, always wash your hands when you're making your food. And I use my fingers too. And it's, you should touch your food. You know, it's beautiful. It's such an earthly, pure experience. I, I just love it. Right? So you just roll around, just marinate it, you know. Massage your food. I love that. Massage, massage. It's going to be in your body. And the, mas the love that you give your food is going to be going inside of you, making you more harmonious, more loving, more cared for, nurtured. Okay. So... So what I will do, I'm going to transfer that into a beautiful, beautiful bowl. Oh, by the way, you know, I eat with the thinner side and the and the the top side. Sometimes I use, you know, use it to just pick up my food like that. There are different ways you can do that. So let me show you what it looks like. Can't wait to eat it. It's so beautiful. And I will take a, a picture of it as well and put it on my blog. And I will put the blog link on the bottom of this video. Last but not least. Okay, so what I do is sprinkle a little bit more of the sesame seed. Be generous with it. And crushed seaweed, roasted seaweed. It has some sesame seeds in it. Put it on top. Mmm, that looks gorgeous. Okay, one last thing. A little bit more. <sighs> that looks so good. Look at that. You want to come over for lunch? Okay, so I'm going to eat now and get ready to go to Paris. I'm going to Paris today. So, and then I'm going to try to make some videos in Paris and look for some raw food restaurants and see what I can find in the grocery stores. I'll make some films and download it. Okay, see you soon, okay? Bye.